Hey, what's up? This is Rob from Panther. Today, we're going to check it out the latest updates in Mid Journey 4. Now you can include like different stylization techniques from zero to a thousand. And the main idea in this, the main takeaway is basically the lower you go with the stylized, for example, on zero, the more control you have with mid journey. On stylized zero, you literally gonna need to include any kind of prompt by yourself. It's like a full manual work versus when you're using like higher numbers, for example, 800, 900, and then the AI is gonna take over and AI is going to do the work for you. You don't need to type in too many prompts, but be aware that the AI is going to do what the AI wants to do. I'm going to show you some examples. This is on style one versus on a style 800. Both have their own styles, stylized one versus stylized 800. Now in some scenarios, you won't notice too much difference, but let's take a look at the next one. This is a scene from Mad Max and the stylized is on a thousand. So everything is perfect photorealistic it doesn't have any issues now we're gonna go down to stylize 10. now here you can see a huge difference because in all four like the glass is like distorted it's like arranged the wrong way the ai don't know what to do because you need to include separately like specific prompts in order to create a correct composition but right now the ai basically puts different kind of pieces of clothing all over his body the sunglasses are all over his face Here's like another one, a scene from Dune. We got like stylize a thousand. It's pretty good. Then we go down to stylize 10. You already can see that the image is falling apart. The model's faces literally look like some balloons. It's just badly proportioned. In stylize zero, you need to be the boss and you need to type in the specific prompts that is going to bring you the right results. And then we have a new update with another prompt. We got like the style 4A and the style 4B. The style 4A basically is the style from the mid journey 4 that they launched at the beginning and style 4b is the current updated mid journey 4 with a newer and updated style now mostly in these scenarios it's going to be like a little bit harder to notice any kind of difference because i tested a couple of images but mostly it's going to highlight it with like interior designs for example, on the style 4A, you can see like more warm lights and you also can see the sun is shining through the windows and you can see the windows shading and it looks more natural. Meanwhile, on the right, the style 4B is more cold looking. It looks more like a 3D render with studio lights, soft boxes and so on. Then there's also like the aspect ratio. This is not a new update, but when they launched Mid Journey 4, they didn't have this. They only had like square aspect ratio, but now you can do like landscapes or Vertical. Now I'm going to show you how to apply these prompts. So for example, here is the fictional character from Dune in middle of desert fashion photography. And here we have the aspect ratio 3 colon 2. This is going to give you like horizontal portraits. And then we got like the aspect ratio 2 by 3. This is going to give you vertical shots. All you need to do is type in slash imagine, click on enter, press control V, space. You just type in line line. And here you can type in these special prompts, for example, stylize space 700 or line line style for A. So these are the updates. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye bye.